Hello everyone, I'm Bobo Wei, and this work was collaborated with Professor Martin Planio, and we are from the Institute of Theoretical Physics, University of Worm. The title of our work is the Relations Between the Dissipated Work and the Family of Ray Divergences. From the title, you can see that our work provides a relation between a concept in thermodynamics and a concept in information theory. Our work was motivated by the Janice famous work in the 1970s. 1997. Uh, Janice discovered a very interesting relation, which is now termed Janice equality. Janice equality says that if we neutralize a system in a thermal equilibrium state, and then drive the system from an initial parameter lambda i to a final parameter lambda f, in this process, actually we do work on the system due to driven. Because the initial state is a GIPS distribution, so the work has a distribution. So we can measure the work distribution function. Janine's equality tells us that if we calculate the average value of the exponential minus beta w with respect to the work distribution, then we get the free energy differences. So the Janine's equality provides a relation between a non-equilibrium measurement to the equilibrium properties of the system. Actually, from, Janine's, from the non-equilibrium work measurement, we can calculate the expected values of, of pw with respect to any function fw. And the Janine's equality is only a special case of this one for taking fw equal to the exponential minus beta w. Here we are motivated and we ask the question, what occurs if we take fw equal to the exponential minus beta w to the power of z, which is a little bit from the Janice equality. Here z is a free parameter. For z equal to 1, it uh, recovers the Janice case. Note that the beta here is not a free parameter. Beta is fixed and it is the temperature of the initial equilibrium state. And it, it turns out that our result is this the equality? On the left hand side, it is the expectation value of exponential work to the power of uh, minus beta w and z. On the right hand side, we actually get two pieces. The first piece is a free energy difference, and the, which is similar to the Janine's equality. And the second piece is a family of uh, Renyi divergence between two states. The Renyi divergence was defined by Renyi in 1961. It gives the distances between two distributions. If we define the dissipated work as a work minus the free energy difference, then this equality can be written as a more complex one. It tells us that the generating function of dissipated work is a family of Renyi divergences. Actually, on the right-hand side, t here can take any values from 0 to tau. So this equality says that, that the, the dissipation is independent of time. And actually, when we take z to 1, this equality t recovers the famous Janine's equality. And we also prove that this equality is, is valid both for finite classical system and for finite quantum system on a time-dependent driven. And finally, and more, or more importantly, our equality tells us a method to measure the quantum Rayleigh divergences. The definition of Rayleigh divergence you can see it is highly evolved, so the measurement of the Rayleigh divergence is difficult. Our equality tells us that we can measure the family of Rayleigh divergences from non-equilibrium work measurement. For the details of our work, you are encouraged to read our paper. Thank you very much.